Let's talk women talk. I'm Shamila, founder of Vicky Scourges, and I'm living with diabetes. In the previous episode, I share with you about my denial and anger and how I come to term with my diagnosis of re diabetic retinopathy. In this episode, I would like to share with you how I come to acceptance of my diagnosis and how I'm going to live life to the fullest. Acceptance to me is seeking knowledge, knowledge about on how to be healthy and definitely being disciplined and of course being fearless. It's not just sitting down and hoping that, um, you know, oh, I'm just, I'm being positive and things will change. No, it's definitely a lot of effort on your side. These days when I meet people who have similar condition as me, I share with them the pain and, and because I understand them and they understand me. So we, we sort of give hope to each other and they themselves are looking forward to get better so that they too can touch other lives together with me. Size doesn't matter whether you're plus size or you're slim. Women are beautiful of all sizes. But when you are sick and unhealthy, how do you feel sexy? In the next three movement, I'm going to show you how to feel sexy and feminine again. Before you begin dancing, it's nice. It's always nice to have a mirror. And then what you need to do first of all is just to spread out your hands. And remember in our first episode, where you hold the cherry. That's how you frame your fingers. Okay, yes, so open up and like you're holding on to a cherry, okay. We're going to do the upwards figure eight. Just slide your hips to the side on the left first and then imagine these hips here, just scoop it up. Then the other side, scoop it up. So this is the movement, it's like scoop, 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 scoop. Okay, and then once you get that right, Frame your finger and then start scooping, scooping, scooping. The last thing you want to do is being belly dancing and looking so serious. Yes, you have to smile. You have to use that sexy voice too. You have to say scoop, scoop. You can't be saying scoop, scoop. Scoop, that sounds like so military, so you have to go scoop. That's upwards figure eight for you. And the second movement is called inverted figure eight, or it was known as Maya in belly dancing. All you have to do is, same thing, just lift up your hips and then push it down. And then lift up here and push it down. Okay, so same thing, we will frame up our finger. Up, down, up, down, up, down. You can go down, all the way down if you want to. And then come up again. The next movement that I'm going to show you is called the camel walk. Tilt your body to the side here. Bend your knees, tuck in your pelvic here. Bring down the tailbone, okay? And the tummy area, all you have to do is just breathe out, push it out. Breathe it in, tuck it in. You can use your leg to kick and tuck in. Kick and tuck in. Breathe in, breathe out. And right now, we are doing the camel walk. There you go. If you like it, you can even walk forward and imagine that you're walking sexily on your problem. Yes, you can walk backwards too. You can go sideways. Whatever ways you want, just walk all over the problems. And remember, whatever situation you are in, don't forget to love yourself at all times. Signing off, Shamila, and I see you next time.